Hello everyone, my name is Forksnapper, and welcome to Stray Cat Crossing. Alright, so this is a game that I was hoping to have a chance to play about a week ago. Actually, two weeks ago, I would say. And uh, I have to take a few steps back. I'm gonna start from the very beginning. And I, I don't think I actually missed anything, just saw like the intro to the story. And you guys will do that soon, or right now. <laughs> Um, I have a little problem with the control keys, so hopefully this won't be a problem now. So, so far I can move with the arrow keys, and um, D is to select stuff, and X is like pressing enter or selecting your menu and all that. And uh, I don't know if C does anything. Let me see. That looks like a no. All right. So now that I got that aside, let's see what we have here. Hey, are you okay? Dot dot dot. What's good? What's wrong? Are you lost? I'm scared. I want to go home. It is pretty late. Do you know where your house is? And... does she? Yes. It's that way. <laughs> well then, let's go. Let's go see it. I can take you home if you want. Think about it. Oh, you don't want to go home? Or don't you want to go home? <laughs> okay. <laughs> she has to think about it. Well, of course she has to think about it. She is talking to a stranger. And now that I think about that, why is she alone? Hmm, what's wrong? Just think about it again. She's cold. <laughs> oh. Hold it. Here, take my scarf. Better? Uh, too tight. <laughs> oh, sorry. It's okay. It wasn't your fault. It wasn't your fault. Okay, I don't get that. Here, let me fix it for you. Better? Warm? Great! By the way, what's your name? Dot dot dot. Cat. <laughs> cat. Nice to meet you, cat. Let's take you home. Alright, so I'm assuming her name is short for Catherine? Or maybe that's actually her name, just Cat. Don't know. No idea. Um, but what caught my interest in about this game is that, um, just the way it looks, it looks fancy pantsy. And, uh, it's considered a horror game. Or psychological horror. And I'm curious as to how scary it would this be because it looks very colorful. And why are they walking in the middle of the road? No idea. Where are the sidewalks in this place? <laughs> Is there even any? Because... Seriously? Why are they walking in the street? Straight cat crossing! Yay! Let's find out what kind of scaries you got. Let's see all the magic. Or let's just start the house. Is this your house? And... She's thinking about it. Yes, here's fine. That probably means no. <laughs> Are you sure? Uh, uh, yes. <laughs> well then, take care, cat. She's thinking about it. Goodbye. <laughs> she has nothing else to say to him. And, oh, she does have something else to say. Um, thank you. <gasps> Run away. Hey, wait, my scarf. Uh-oh. Can't lose that scarf. And I'm assuming this is where you make the biggest mistake of your life. Assuming there's going to be something terrible in the house. Or not. Hello? Da da da. Hmm. The door is open. Enter. Yes. I like the way this character looks. Like, especially her hair. I'm assuming she, right? Cat. And she left footprints. Oops. Footprints. Cat must have went this way. Alright, this is where I got stuck. <laughs> and when I tried playing, I actually made it up to this point and saw this guy over here. Let's see. What do you do? P picture? Uh, sure. Hold still. Ooh! Okay, cool, we can save. I am saving. 
Okay, so... Can I touch this stuff? Nothing here? Oh, I could! Cool! Alright, so... A blue sofa. It's... It's seen better days. So it sounds like it's an old sofa. Alright, so... I can walk here. So earlier I was trying to walk around here and I had, like... It was acting like it was a table. But then that's when I realized there was something wrong with the... Uh, my... My controls. Kinda creepy, but mesmerizing. Alright. Complete poems. Emily Dickinson. I've heard of her. I've heard of her too. A red seat. The felt is so worn. Alright. Why are we going through the stuff here? It's fake, but it looks realistic. But if you know it's fake, then... Then how would it look realistic? You know what? Never mind. I was about to... I'm probably speaking gibberish at the moment. It's just a kitten stool. I should just go follow the tracks. <laughs> I need to find out where this girl is. Give me my scarf. And the sound here... I don't know if I should be worried. Even the walls are... Okay. Cat, are you in here? It's locked. Uh-oh. And, uh... Okay. I don't know if I made a mistake by coming in here. Ooh. Look, look. Look at the hag. Look what the cat dragged in. Okay. A guest, a guest. We must look our best. We've never had a guest before. A sight for sore eyes, isn't it? That's a sore lie, isn't it? Isn't it? Isn't it? He. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Who are you? Don't be so innocent. He. <laughs> he. Hear that? Hear that? Weird that. Well, she never met us, did she? So I was right. So is she? Did she? Did she? Precious, didn't she? Have you seen a little girl around? Little girl? Little girl? Aren't you a little girl? <laughs> okay. I'd like to leave, please. She'd like to leave. To leave? The nerve! The peeve, we grieve. Uh, is there a way out? <laughs> out? Yes. Doubt? Yes. <laughs> a favor, I declare a favor. A favor? Honor the favor and then she can leave. The nerve, the peeve. Uh, <laughs> okay, what is the favor? Our favor, she asks. Uh, please, miss, it's not a hard task. This stupid, useless. Whoa, 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 whoa! You just said everything really fast. Okay. The stupid, useless, wrinkly, stinkly, pea brained, stud faced, fly ridden, flea bitten, stop, slop smelling, dung dwelling, <laughs> purchasing, pistols, pile of a mutt here. Whoa. Can you tell me its name? Okay. <laughs> Here, here. Then you can leave. Leave us behind. How unkind. What an interesting game so far. Let's, uh... What the? A dog, I think? So... This turned into a puzzle-solving thing. And, and it has a... There's a sink in a mirror. It has a human or baby face. It kind of looks more like a baby face. So, a nice sculpture of a swan. It's beautiful. And that's in here. How? <laughs> Unless they sculpted inside here, which would make sense. Hey, it's that guy again. Picture. Yes. Hold still. And save my picture. Thank you very much. Okay. So let's, uh... Ooh, this is another area. Don't know if I'm supposed to be in here. What is this? It's an old diary. Read entry? Yes. May 18, 1912. To be honest, I find her back garden as terrifying. Terrifying as 
it is fascinating. The creatures that lurk here, lurk there can only be described as cunning and monstrous. And yet the plants that take root there, I never could have dreamed of them. The flora seemed ordinary, but their properties are, I dare say, magical. For example, the extract of rose emanates warmth even in the coldest conditions. The rest is scribbled out. Okay, that's important information. A planet model hangs over the crib. Okay. And there's something else here. A plane model hangs over the crib. And whatever this is, a dead bird hangs over the crib. Okay. Anything else that we need to know? A blanket hung on the wall. It has pink rabbits on it. And we can't uncover that. A blanket hung on a wall. It has yellow ducks on it. Alright, so let's see what is this stuff. A flask containing a red chemical. Can't touch this. A rack of test tubes. Ooh, I can take that. Got a test tube. To view items in your inventory, press X to open the menu. Alright. Alright, so that's empty. And how do I go back? There you go. Let's see, maybe I could use this. A flask containing a red chemical. Fill test tube? Yes. I don't know if that's a good idea. Let's see if we can take another. Aha! I can take one. And there's other stuff here. Let's do that. See a beaker containing a green chemical. I'll need the last test too. I wonder if I'm gonna have to combine them or something. Let's fill that up. So, can we combine these things? Wait. Can I put it here? Horn sheep skull hanging over the fireplace. Its mouth is chained and locked shut. Okay. Blanket hung on a wall. It has yellow ducks. Alright, so I don't know what to do with these tubes, but bird keys without a bird. I'm gonna read this part one more time. So let's see. Gardens, terrifying. Maybe I have to go there. Plants to take root there. Never dream of them. Magical. The extractor rose emanates warmth, even in the coldest conditions. Okay, maybe I'll need the red potion for some cold area. Uh oh. What? Okay! Was not expecting that. Don't know what that's supposed to be, but let's save just in case. Yes, please take my picture. Be, please be Ponto. Yay! Okay. So, let's see. There's a mirror here. Nope, just nothing. Let's see, hmm, what do you want? I can't, they can't tell me anything else. And you're saying the same thing over and over. Can you tell me its name? No, I cannot. Then shoot, move along. <laughs> I'll find out its name at some point. I hope. <laughs> what? It's locked. Oh, I still have to do stuff. Oh, wait a minute. I probably have to mess this thing up here. It's beautiful. Forward potion over swan? Yes. I will melt it. Melt its beauty. The swan melted instantly. Sorry, swan, but I gotta do important stuff like find out how to get out of this this strange house. Hopefully I didn't need another red potion. And that is a very tall nutcracker. Will you have anything important? Ah, nuts. Ah, nuts. Okay. Ah, I gotta find some nuts. An old film reel. Pick it up? Yes, we shall. Maybe that will tell me the name of the... A bus of someone important. No other information? A golden plaque. In memory of Sean Faust? Or Jo- Joanne. Dr. John Faust. Okay, I don't know. Not sure if I'm saying that name right, but... Let's see if we can put it in the film here. Play film reel? Yes. Yes, let's see what this has to offer. Babyface? Faust, the dog. Ah, oh, okay, cool. And it can't- it can't touch that. <laughs> Uh, yep, that's the dog. 
Uh, son? Oh, you're related. Uh oh. What the? Finn. Okay. <laughs> well, I. Oh. Okay. Hi there. It's offering an egg. Take the egg? Yes. I will gladly take that egg. I... Okay. So, the dog has the face of Faust. An old-fashioned record player. Not... I don't know what to, to think about that. Projector screen. I got a guitar. Someone snapped its neck. Don't blame that one on me. No old bass. Its strings are broken. And nothing else. Why is there a lamp post indoors? That's a good question. Probably it's not an actual lamp post, but just as a decoration thing going on. If that makes sense. Okay. That looks disturbing. But I'm gonna ignore that. And hopefully I'll be a okay. And I can now tell you the name of this dog. Yes. His name is Faust. I would have thought too that because of the plaque that might have been a hint. Correct, correct, yes. Okay, correct? How? Foul play, I suspect. <laughs> okay. Must be, must be. Must be. Must we ask for another favor? Another one? Must we? We must. We mustn't hate her. Another favor will right the wrong. You hate me already? I don't even know you guys. Favors for favors. Bring us the favorite food of the ram. Well, damn. <laughs> now scram. Okay. Wait a minute. Maybe that was in the tire? No. Maybe I should look back in this room? And it will give me all the answers. Hopefully. I really hope. <laughs> Wait a minute. Maybe this was the hint. Give the egg to him. Ooh. I think I'm gonna give it. No, not that. Not again. No more. Please no more. Uh. Okay. So it doesn't want the egg. Maybe the ram likes the egg. Hmm. Okay, so I'm gonna save this. And, um, I think I'll just save this for another time, too. Uh, this is pretty interesting and also very weird. And not exactly scary, but so far, I'm liking it. I really like it. <laughs> Alright, so, how far have I played, too? I'm curious. Yeah, I went pretty far on this one, so I'm gonna stop for now, so thanks for sticking around, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye!